Yo, yo, guys, another video. So, there was another video where we was just eating, right? But this is Saraga International Store, second location. And I'm here with Shami. I don't know where she's at. She's somewhere over here. But if you're in Columbus, Ohio, you can always come to Saraga if you want different cultural foods, right? If you want Asian foods, they actually have section for Asian people. They have African food. They have like Mexican food or other Latino or Hispanic food. They have all kind of stuff you can think about. So we're just gonna take a little journey through here. This is the Saraga in Columbus, Ohio, the second location. The first location is on Morris Road, but this is the second location. And yeah, I'm gonna show a little bit of Shammy vlogging. I'm gonna show a little bit of the store and let's do this. Shammy, how are you liking the new Saraga? Oh, it's so, the lighting is amazing. Yeah, it is. The lighting is amazing. It's funny because- I was actually so concerned about that. We, we, we needed that lighting uh, over, over there. <laughs> we needed that lighting over there. <laughs> Hold on, but you, you come to Saraga a lot, don't you? Yes, I do. And I, I shop from the, the meat section. I get my spices. I like Saison seasoning. Um, the, yeah, the srirachas and the soy sauces. And, Hold on, but and don't I you... get cornmeal, too. Like, in that yam. one right there. In yams. <laughs> yams, the fig the... section, yes. Uh, avocados. Mm. Oh, you know. Yeah, and um, noodles. Pastas. But you know, it's interesting that they had uh, sugar cane over there. Did you ever see the sugar canes? The big sugar canes? What? They have it? Yeah, let's go see it. It's oh, over... Well, I, uh, down. Let's see. Like, why shouldn't I get it? So they, so they have, like, tropical fruits and stuff so that people want, like, you know... Yeah, because I always wanted to just suck on a sugar cane because I've never done it yet. You've never done it? Nah, I've never done it. It's a rite of passage. It is, but I don't even know if they have it right now. Let's see. Where, where was it at last time that I came? I came here a long time ago. It would be off season. Nah, so like they're this is a yam. Remember we're talking about yam? So oh yeah, yeah, yeah. This is so okay. So just explain and it to me. That, so it's, this is a yam. But explain it to me when it's bad or it's good. Because when I came with my Ghanaian friend, he was like going through like different yams and okay, trying so to figure I out when it's bad. I don't know different yams. So I'm not from uh, like a West African country. I'm from Southern Africa. Of course. But this is a yam. It's a root. It's a root. You know? So do you know how to cook yams? Like when I mean, when it comes to just like buying them and cooking them, you don't. <laughs> look at you. I would have to look it up. I thought you. Were, I thought you was a real West African, so no. But. No. <laughs> <laughs> and this is sweet potato, and this is what most. Well, I know Americans what to do with. Call, yeah, I know what to yeah. do with this. Yeah. So this is what we what Americans call yams, but this is an actual yam. Hmm. But you know, it's funny because I think the last time that I came, which was in the summertime, was. Probably the sugar canes was like somewhere around here. Yeah, it's, it's, but I don't think those are sugar canes. Let, let's go over to the. It's a summer food. Where do you want to go? Uh, over there to the fruits. It it might possibly be there, but I don't know for sure I if it know. is or not. It's a summer food. <laughs> I'm still like hoping that they import it and they still have them, but maybe not though. Can we go back the same way we came out? Cause that's why I parked. Yeah, 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 we we can go over there. Look, they're right there. What? Oh yeah, right there. Yeah, look at this. <laughs> yeah, let's buy the sugar cane. And let's, so what do you do with it? Do you like suck on them? Do you cut them? And like, how do you actually do that? I would feel so, we're buying it? You want it? No, I'm not buying it. Cause I don't know what to do with it. <laughs> I think they'd be putting it through a machine and they, sometimes they make like sugar cane, yeah, uh, it's like a base, base juice. Uh, so, this oh, it's over there. Okay, so this is what we typically, these are like, Yo, them is sort of... Okay, so these are not like, these are not like the best. So typically you want the purple one, mm -hmm. but that looks like the, that has this width. You want a long, like between each uh, knot, you want it to be longer. So why do you want the purple one? Is there a reason? Is it, it like, is one not ripe and one, I mean, is that no, even no, no, a thing with it? No, no, they just taste a little bit different. Oh, okay. Um, I think, I'm not sure. Mm -hmm. I know this one. Um, so yeah, you would chop it. You chop it right here. Mm -hmm. Okay and then you peel it it's like you kind of strip down peel they're a little bit hard you mm -hmm. strip down peel it mm -hmm. and then you eat the center you suck on the center mm -hmm. kind of chew and suck it's crunchy mm -hmm. um but you chew and you spit okay crunchy like pineapple mm -hmm. like imagine that part of pineapple that you don't eat oh the yeah, yeah, yeah the middle part that's kind yeah. of the concept you know crunchy juicy high sugar content mm -hmm. and then you toss it very refreshing amazing Love Yo, it. I have to have one of these one day. I'm, in the summertime, I just don't feel like it's proper to eat it right now and do this right now. But in the spring, we're going to come back and I I'm feel like do. now that I know that they're here, the next time we do something, we're, we're going to get sugar cane. Yeah, okay. Because, like, 
for sure. I, I didn't expect to find them here. Nah, I when I yeah, when I first saw it, I was like, yo, this is really international out here. Okay. Oh yeah, for sure. <laughs> Got the sugar cane. Typically, I see things like guava and this. Okay. Show me some more uh, fruits. Melon. Oh, you're they talking about the, it, the uh, yeah, Kiwano Kiwana? melon. Yeah, yeah. Uh, they taste better. They taste less sweet, mm. more like cucumber when they're green. Mm. Um, but not like not like green, not ripe. So obviously they put them in a truck and bring them, you know. So do you world. just eat them in general, or is there like any dishes you know of that they? they you don't cook these. It's a fruit. Oh, it's just a fruit. Just okay, eat it. okay. Yeah, it's like a cucumber. Oh. Hmm. Yeah, literally. Uh, they call it a horned melon. I think these are native to my home country and neighboring country. I think I'm not sure if they're native to Asia as well. Native to my home country, pretty good. Tip, they're not sweet. Oh, they're not sweet. Oh, okay. They're, they're they're sweet you, like. You, you missed me at that, Sana. They're not like sweet. They're, they're, they're sweet. They're sweet like tropical fruit sweet, so not sweet at all. Oh, got you, got you. Like a like a mild sweet. Okay, tangy. And then. Okay, I thought this was guava. It's not guava. Not a sweet lime. Whatever that means. Yes. Is it? Is there such thing as a sweet lime? <laughs> I would, thought there was the all thing. sour, yeah. You think you know everything? I, I mean, I don't know everything. Well, there's so many different fruits and vegetables in just, the world, of course. Like you start wondering, like what you're asking, like how do you cook this? What do you do with this? What is this? So many questions. Exactly. I need answers right now. Who's the wizard that knows how to cook everything? Some people out know there? about food. Some people know about food. You want to go out this way, right? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Because actually, I think they have uh, another aisle of all these plant. What is it? The plantain, plantain chips? chips. Why not? I, didn't, I think I just kind of found a flavor I like. Mm. I think the only... So I don't know. There's some nice flavors over here. There's like... They got spicy flavor. Oh my god. I love Mexican baked goods. Mexican, oh Mexican baked goods might be one of the best baked goods for real. I, I feel like people don't even realize how good Mexican baked... Yeah. How much... Like Mexican bakeries, I'd be like, okay. I love them. They are. Yeah. It's so dope that uh and then look you got the little Asian section where you got all the this reminds me of like my Cambodian friends and stuff. Yeah. I need to come buy some of these stuff. Like hot uh, like you yes. can use oh that's yeah, that's a Mexican but then you you could do like hot pots and have like all this traditional Mexican stuff. This you're is really dope. Cook, you know, when you got the right. <laughs> right, right. We got the right stuff, you know? Well, this is the second uh, Saraga. How you, how you how you like it? I'm 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10. 10, 10. Yeah, I would actually come shop with this right now. I'm going to tell my mom about it. She lives really close Yeah, yeah, definitely. I'm going to come back here and buy a couple of things uh, one day. But I think last time I was here was in the springtime. And then, uh, oops, sorry. And, uh, I just haven't been out here since, you know, when it be getting cold, yeah, I'll be... Live, you live on the other side of the city. Yeah, I live all the way on the other side of the city. <laughs> but then also you didn't... Well, this Saraga, they have so many different type of, like, stores, too. I like that. It's sort of like a mm -hmm. mini... It's sort of like, like a one-stop shop. Yeah, yeah. Because yeah, they have, like, the this he and she fashion. Uh, you can go all the way to the end and go to the left. Oh, no, the, the mochi ice cream? Yeah, have you tried it? You, nah, but I tried mochi and I hated it. Me too. I hated it. I, I don't do, um, I don't Asian do Asian desserts are not, based desserts. yeah, Asian yeah, desserts well, is not my favorite for yeah. it. I ain't going front. Especially like Indian desserts, it's too much milk, it's too much, you know what I'm uh, saying? too sweet, too. Too sweet, yeah. yeah. Mochi is pretty cool, it's like, um. It's too chewy, it's Japanese, it's yeah, too, yeah. I don't like mochi. It's like a rice ice cream thing going yeah. on, right? But I had so many, I had so much Japanese things that I love, but mochi is not one of them. Yeah. I, I, I feel like everything that chants is just not me. I don't think I hate boba, but I don't love boba. I don't like I don't like boba because it's tapioca and it has no taste. I like the 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 fruits, like the uh -huh. in the in the, in the thing. yeah, and like the cause we used to, we used to have a place called Momos uh -huh. on campus, and it was like an all Asian place, and it had bowling, they had karaoke, it was dope. Yeah, but I like I, never I had don't it. like boba, which trended. I don't like um, what's the green tea. The one that's oh, green. Uh, mochi tea or just green tea? The tea, yeah. Mo mochi, mochi, mochi or mocha, mochi tea. I've the name. 
I don't like that tea. I don't like anything flavored that way. Right, and look, they got a barbershop right here in case you want to like get your hair cut. They said haircuts, razor shaves, hair Yo, everything. Locks, get your locks retwisted. Oh my God, I forgot that it's so cold outside. It is cold, guys. Jesus, I'm not ready for this. You know that they said that they, they said this week is tomorrow. I think it's gonna be like 17 degrees or 10 degrees. Oh my God, where are you parking? Uh, right here, just like okay, to the left of this right yeah, here. I'm, I'm but yo, guys, look, we went to Saragas. Look, as a matter of fact, we needed to make a, <laughs> a selfie. <laughs> I don't know if we're in it. I don't know if we are in it, but we'll make let it me, work. Let me let me do a little. Uh, 